up YouTube, it's your boy the Franchise Guy, come back at you again with another episode of Madden 19, my career featuring your boy Chance Bishop. I mean, taking on the Giants right now, I mean, we went 4-0, start the season off, pretty good, pretty good, it's a shame Doug Peterson is no longer here, you gotta think that this team that this coach, I don't even know what this coach's name is, I don't care what this coach's name is because it's not Doug Peterson. Can't believe he retired. He's a Hall of Famer though. It's, it's what it is, you know? But, uh, this coach, he isn't Doug Peterson. We don't really have any loyalty to this coach. I mean, we start off 4 0. Um, it really is a shame that Dougie P isn't here to lead us to 5 0. Maybe even 8 and 0 by the end of this episode. Who knows? Got a lot of episode left to watch just to see where we end up. Get into second quarter. Got a play action pass. And that is one of the worst play actions I've ever seen. Chance Bishop just runs down the quarterback right there. His 18th sack of the season. He had a goal of 15 sacks for the entire season. 15! Five games into the season, he's at 18. I think that's also what happens when you set a single game record for sacks. And like, what, was it the fourth week of the season? Third week of the season, we had a 10 sack game. 20th sack of the season with this. Maybe that was our 19th sack. The previous sack, not a, not 18. But uh, we're killing it right now. We really are. I mean, five games, that's four sacks a game right there. I mean, we're a little ahead of that pace, it seems like. I mean, at least if we get another sack this game, we're a little ahead of four sacks a game. I mean, but four sacks a game, that's unheard of right there. That's a sack a quarter. And I just don't know, like, what to do because we're getting another sack right there. We're getting our third sack this game. I mean... Demetrius Turner, the head coach of the Eagles, wanted a four-sack game from this team. We have three of them. That's our 21st sack of the season. So right now, we're just a little ahead of four sacks a game. Fourth, fourth and long, right there. Will Grimes going to throw it up. Interception. He's just going to end this game right here. That's just how it be right there. Interception to end the game. Minute 19 left. Malcolm Butler... He's on a quest for another ring. We know he wants to win another ring. That's why he came to the Eagles. We end up winning 20 to 10, 140 passing yards, 100 rushing yards, and that pick to end the game right there. Real nice, real nice um, start to the season, really, for the Eagles. 5 and 0 right now. I mean, take it on. What is this? The Titans. Yeah, Tennessee Titans right here in this game. This is going to be a game right here. This was probably... I don't know. This might get Chance Bishop coined a nickname in Philly. I'm pretty sure it's this game. Maybe it's next time we play Tennessee. But I'm 99% sure it's this game right here. Where uh, all pandemonium breaks loose because of Chance Bishop. Still upset that we're not a captain. Don't know why we're not a captain. You know, we pretty much lead the league in, you know, sacks. Every, for the past three years, we've led the lead in sacks. And uh, we're not even a captain. Like, that's not cool. Like, what is that? How, how are we not a captain? We're the best defensive player in the league. And we're not a captain. Head coach of Titans. A little different, too. He's not, uh, he's not Mike Malarkey. Definitely not Mike Malarkey right there. I know that for a fact. Second 10 right now. Is it McCaffrey in the backfield? Play action pass. Doesn't matter. Chance Bishop's going to get a sack right there on Mariota. I mean, look at that. He's just egging these Eagles fans on. He's hyping them up. Chance Bishop is a man of Philadelphia right here. That yeah, Chance Bishop wearing any other jersey is just not possible to see. If you see Chance Bishop in a different color jersey, it's because the Eagles have lost their minds. 
Right now, taking on the running back, Duke Johnson Jr. Get the tackle right there. Only gains a one. Forces the fourth down right there. Forces the punt. Third and five right now. Gonna shed that tackle, and we're gonna get the sack. Our second sack of the game. I mean, we get these nice little dances in. Chance Bishop's having fun. Look at that. Mario's trying to roll out, trying to throw those running back in the backfield. Chance Bishop doesn't give him the chance. His third sack of the game. Look at that. Bishop is a one-man wrecking crew. He is a butcher of quarterbacks. Pack your sack lunches. Because, uh, Chance Bishop right there, injuring Marcus Mariota on the throw, backup quarterback right here, and he's hurt too, Chance Bishop hurts the second quarterback of the game, get the third stringer in, and first thing he's got to deal with is a sack from Chance Bishop, his third and a half of the game, forcing a Fourth and 15, or fourth and long, fourth and a long time, really. We went 10 to nothing, but Chance Bishop on record injuring two quarterbacks. That is a game right there. He's rewarded with a training point right there. Upgrade the power rush, get that to a 95 overall. I mean, at this point, we don't even really need to upgrade anything. We're, we're just the best player in the league, hands down. Regardless. Taking on Tampa Bay right now. We never, I don't think we really had that great of luck against Zane Abbott and the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, at least sacking him wise. I know every once in a while we get like a sack or two against him, but I don't think we've ever had like a four or five sack game like we have against uh, the Redskins or the Giants or the, or the Cowboys. I don't think we've actually had a five sack game against the Cowboys either. But uh, yeah, definitely Zane Abbott right here, number two. Replace Jameis Winston Winston, who is a uh, cowboy, by the way. I'm pretty sure he was in the last episode. But Mike Evans still on the team right there. Last week, 11 receptions, 135 yards, two touchdowns, long of 31. But Zane Abbott on his knee, praying to his Lord and Savior, whomever that may be, that Chance Bishop does not get in the backfield today because Chance Bishop will ruin a quarterback's day. And speaking of ruining a quarterback stay, Chance Bishop gets in there with Gallipo on the half sack right there. Just, you know, Gallipo gets him from the front, Bishop gets him in the back. You know, get a little whiplash action right there. Second and 18 right now. And that's just another sack. That's Chance Bishop's first full sack of the game. 25th sack of the season. Going into what's it, the seventh game. He's just a little on pace, a little ahead of his four uh, sacks a game. Maybe he's a little behind, really. Four times seven is twenty-eight. So he's on pace. He got a safety right here. Count. I'm pretty sure it counts as a sack right there. Demetrius Turner not looking thrilled by uh, Chance Bishop's sack. Don't know why. You have the most exciting defensive player in the league. And uh, look at that. Chance Bishop hurts former Eagles tackle Lane Johnson. Chance Bishop's just too much man for Lane Johnson. Johnson, who's been off the PEDs for a while right now, can't handle a man in his prime. Can't handle the linebacker number 52. Not possible. Second and 10 right there. Zane now is going to get picked off by Ronald Darby. Darby, we're just going to go to the house. Just run this score up. It is 22 to 10 in the second quarter. This game isn't even halfway over yet and they're already blowing them out by more than three touchdowns I mean 22 to nothing before the second quarter is even over yet third and nine on the fourth Bishop you know gonna get in there on another great play for Bishop right there I mean look at that seven total sacks for the Eagles this game Fourth and 26 right now. Abbott's going to throw it up. And he's going to be picked off by Ronald Darby yet again. Darby trying for a second pick six. Doesn't quite get there. Runs into the defenders. Two interceptions. Three tackles. His 20th career interception. Not too shabby. It's a shame the Eagles are probably going to let Darby walk during free agency. But uh, Malcolm Butler... Wants to get on the action. He's going to get an interception just to end the game off right here. 
I mean, that's just a lot of interceptions thrown by Abbott. I get it. He's trying to win the game, but it's 15 seconds left. Demetrius Turner not looking too happy. Three takeaways, all on interceptions for the Eagles. They fucking just outpassed us, which is weird. We outrushed them by uh, 162 yards, though. Even that a little bit, I guess. Imagine of it even out. Uh, number 12 right here, not too happy. Not too happy one bit. Ah, uh, how's that? I Good win. I forget what his name is. Uh, take on the Redskins right here. Accidentally skipped the intro crawl. It happens sometimes. Not not often, but sometimes it happens. Bishop, though, getting a sack on the quarterback right there, as usual. His 30th sack of the season and the 8th game of the season. So was that? 8 times... 8 times 4. What is that? That is 32. That's 32 right there. So we're... We're on pace for four sacks a game. I mean, we don't always need to get sacks. Sometimes we can get tackles. Jordan Hicks, though, out with an injury right now. Injury timeout for the Eagles. Not not the greatest. A second seven right now. Four chance Bishop. And uh, we're going to get a second sack of the se uh, season of the game. That's our 31st of the season. I mean, Demetrius Turner... Wants four sacks again. That's not enough for this Eagles. This Eagles team had seven sacks last game. He's like, ah, four. Four sacks is fine. I'm not the biggest fan of Demetrius Turner. I'm really not. I, I miss Dougie P. Second and 11 for this Eagles team. Uh, we're going to get credit with a half a sack here, it seems like. Uh, I'm not entirely sure how we got credit with part of a sack. I guess we grabbed him by his ankle. This time, though... We're not worried about half a sack. We're getting a whole sack right here. Showing Galippo, though, even though we just wrecked the quarterback. And there's some emotion out of Demetrius Turner for once. We finally get some emotion out of this guy. Great to see. Uh, another sack right here. Just leveling. And I mean leveling this Redskins quarterback right there. Fourth and a half sack of the game. Five tackles. Get a little dance going on. like to see what right, that right there. Third quarter. I mean, we're a little ahead of our four sacks a game right there. Our fifth and a half sack of the game, six tackles. You know, James Bishop is mocking this crowd FedEx for now. He is begging for them to say something to him. Because he is single-handedly taking this team down. And we got another half sack right there. Give George Jordan hits the half sack. So we're about seven sacks in one game. Wild. We win 17 to nothing, 195 passing yards, 85 rushing yards. Uh, skins though with two takeaways. Not not the best thing to see right there. But if you guys like this episode, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. If you guys missed an episode, make sure you guys check us down below. Do upload content daily, so always be tuned for more episodes of more other series, I guess. 